It's 514 beginning today. Palm Beach County parents can decide whether their kids will stay in remote or in person learning for the rest of the semester. The school district says this could really help eliminate some simultaneous teaching and provide more remote work opportunities for teachers. So new this morning, WPTV News Channel 5 Stephanie Suskind spoke to one teacher about the current struggles inside the classroom. Students and teachers are beginning their third week back on campus today, and one teacher took me inside his classroom to explain the challenges of this new teaching environment and what he hopes will change. Obviously, you know, stressful. Um, we've been doing what we can. Atlantic High School theater teacher Stephen Berlanga shared these pictures of his socially distanced classroom. Caution tape surrounds desks that are off limits to students. Doing the simultaneous teaching, um, it's been a struggle trying to keep the kids that are online engaged while also keeping the kids in class engaged. He says that's the most difficult part of teaching in this COVID-19 era. Especially like because it's theater, so it's collaborative and it's a lot of group work. Berlanga says he sees less than 10 students a day in person and some have chosen to return home. After that first week, a lot of kids went back to virtual. Um, because their friends weren't here and they weren't getting the socializing they thought they were going to get. This fluidity is taxing our teachers and many of our departments throughout the district. That's why Berlanga is encouraged. The district will ask students to lock in their choice for distance or in-person learning. I want our educators, our students, and our parents to know we hear you. We understand your concerns. Hoping that can help ease the burden. Then we would be able to determine, like, okay, this, this teacher can be remote for this subject area. If we had just done that from get go, then this wouldn't be an issue. Now, Berlanga tells me for the most part, he feels safe with the precautions on campus and they seem to be working. However, he does choose to eat lunch in his car most days. Again, that make your choice question goes live in the student portal today and you'll have until October 14th to lock in your decision. I'm Stephanie Suskind. Back to you.